place today, Lola. Sniff Dog Hotel. Let's go say hi to your friends. Hi, welcome to Sniff Dog Hotel. Thanks, I'm here with Lola. Today we're here at the Sniff Dog Hotel and I'm here with the owners, Corey and Casey Murray. What are you guys going to show me today? Well, Kelsey, thanks for coming today and uh, why don't we take a look around? Nice. Then we'll go to the cafe and get a beer and a glass of wine. Sounds great. Let's go. All right, Corey, this is our first stop on yes. the tour of your facility. Where are we at? What is this? This is our self-service dog wash. This is for all our owners that can bring their, their dogs in here and give them a quick bath. We have a lot of owners that take their dogs on hikes to Forest Park and they've got a nice muddy dog. Before they go home and ruin their carpet, they can bring them right here, get them all nice and clean. How cute. So is it okay, like, can people come in here and just like well, take a bath? And mm. I mean, do they normally come in here too? No, we haven't seen that quite yet. This this is a first. Is it okay if uh, I come in and take a bath every once in a well, while? Sorry, Kelsey, it's actually just for our dog, yes. Okay. Alright, let's go to the next place. Alright, Corey, this is the biggest area here in your hotel. Yes. Where are we? This is our dog park. So this is where our dogs get to play all day. Um, we have our daycare dogs that come just for the day, but also our boarding guests get to come down and play throughout the, the day as well. I'm noticing day. that this is a lot cleaner than a regular park. Yes. Probably the greatest thing we got here is you'll notice from our flooring. It's called canine grass. It's um, actually designed specifically for this type of application. So first and foremost, what's great about it is it's, as you can feel, it's nice and soft, kind of like running on re regular grass. So it's easy on the dog's paws and their joints so it doesn't wear them down. Um, but the other really neat thing about it is it actually, we actually have a filtration system underneath. So when a dog, um, does their business. Um, it actually flows right through the grass down to the concrete floor and we actually flush water from underneath and we have drains under here as well so we remove the waste underneath and the neat thing about that also is the fact that it allows our dog handlers out here to have more time to interact and play with the dogs other than mopping all day long. So you actually pay people to play with dogs all day? Yes we do. <laughs> Do you need any helpers? Are you hiring right now? Well, sure. Do you want a job? <laughs> yes, I'm in. <laughs> That's cute. I see like a little uh, jungle gym area. Or yes. What's that for? Is That's that... actually a newer addition that we put in the last couple months, and it's it's been a huge hit. Um, the dogs love to just climb up and you know play king of the mountain, or also you'll see the little tunnels under there, and they like to <laughs> bob and weave through there and hide out and just. You know, it's just a fun little interactive toy for them to play with. Well, this is an amazing area. What a fun little playground for all the dogs. Yeah. So sure. after they've played all day and they want to go take a nap, where, where are they going to do that if they're staying right. here at the hotel? Well, let me show you. All right. Yeah, let's all go. Right. Okay, Corey, so now we're upstairs in the hotel room. And what kind of hotel rooms do you guys have here at Sniff Dog? Well, what you're looking at right here is our deluxe suite. Okay. This is one thing that makes us pretty unique here. Um, probably the greatest thing about these rooms in particular is one, the space. Um, as you can see, they're large, 65 square feet plus on all these rooms. Um, and then they have floor to ceiling windows for the dogs to be able to look out, get a nice little view. Um, uh, it's a nice view of Portland. Yes, yeah, of course. Um, the other thing they have is we actually have TVs in each of these rooms as well. Um, as you can see today, they're getting their sports fix, watching a little football. I like to play a lot of programs uh, with a lot of commentary, just to hear a lot of voices and such. It helps it really uh, keep the stress levels down for them when they're away from home. Basically, the only thing the owners need to bring is, of course, their dogs and their food, and we take care of the rest. Great. So this is called the Deluxe Suite? Correct. All right, and then is there even a nicer suite than this one? Well, matter of fact, we do have our penthouse suite just beyond this door. This is our penthouse suite. This is huge. Yes, um, as you can see, um, 
lots of space. Probably the, the most unique part of this room is the fact that it has a webcam up there in the corner. This is our only room that does have a webcam, so that's why it's kind of our grand penthouse. And you can log in anytime and see what Correct. your dog is doing? Yes, it's only accessible by the owners that, that book this room. We give them a username and password at check-in, and then they can log in and check them out anytime, even from their iPhones. Oh, how cute. Oh my gosh, a spa and salon for dogs. Yes, that's right. Um, this is our grooming salon and spa. Um, where we do uh, haircuts for your dogs and baths. Um, we have two amazing groomers, Jen and Adrian. Between the two of them, about 20 years of experience grooming all sorts of breeds of dogs. So, and we're open um, to groom your dog seven days a week. Um, we also do um, baths as well. Um, so we can give them a full on bubble bath, which is basically nail trim, give them a nice brush out, shampoo, you know, so they're nice and clean and ready to go. Can I get my hair cut in here? Yeah, sure, why not? Do you guys do cut and colors for dogs? Um, we actually do uh, what we call our potty cures, and that's where we actually paint their nails. Oh my gosh. And I've noticed that there is a great view um, even yes. in here, so how relaxing for the dogs. It's oh, yeah. not just a, um, a salon where they get their hair done, but it's also right. kind of got that spa feeling where they're relaxed. Exactly. Great, now let's go to the next spot. All right. Okay. Ooh, my stomach's growling. Do you have any snacks for me in here? Well, we might have a few things. Um, Kelsey, this is our kitchen. Okay. Um, so this is probably the most important room in the house. Because this is where you see on this back wall, this is where we keep all the dog's food and belongings when they stay here. So this is where you prepare everyone's dishes. Do you do it um, at the same time every day? Yes, we do. So um, we have breakfast service, um, we have a lunch service, and then a dinner service. Of do you have stuff. room service? Uh, we do, actually. We uh, we have little special Kong treats uh, that we can prepare for them. Do you ever catch dogs coming in here and trying to get a midnight snack? Well, uh, it's funny you say that. I know my dog in particular likes to try to sneak out of my office and come to this room. So they know this is where the goods oh, yeah. are. Oh yeah, this is this is the this is where the mother load is, of course. So over here, this is our little prep table where we prepare all the meals. Oh, it looks oh. like someone left some extra food. Yeah, I don't know if I would starving. recommend I that. Am starving. Really, Kelsey? Oh. Uh, how's that? It tastes really good. <laughs> Do you serve this in the cafe? Um, no, we do. We, okay. We have good. 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 Items here. <laughs> All right, let's go to the cafe so I can wash this down. <laughs> Now I'm here with Casey Murray and we're in the cafe part of the hotel. My favorite thing about the Sniff Dog Hotel is that you can bring your dog here to play while you're drinking a beer. Tell me about that. Oh yeah. So I think that is everyone's favorite thing. Um, you know, they, they come in here after work, a stressful day, and they can come drop their dog off. The dog gets their energy out. They get their, you know, they get their beer, they relax, you know, before they go home. So it's kind of like a two birds, one stone sort of thing. Um, with our, you know, customers that are use the hotel and our daycare, they love it. it they, I think that they feel kind of part of like a club, like a little, you know, a little small social club, and where you know, kind of make it part of their week, you know, their week routine. So. I'm glad that we can offer that sort of service to our customers here at Sniff. So you guys have a happy hour each day? Yes. Yeah, so we have a happy hour six days a week, um, and it is from 5 to 7 p.m. And so basically what we did is a free dog daycare um, in the park from that time, 5 to 7. And, um, you know, people will come in here, hang out together, friends, family, um, couples, and and they, you know, watch their dogs play in the dog park. So with our espresso menu, you know, we started right from the day one. We have um, themed drinks like the Chocolate Lab, the Westie, the Golden Retriever, and when people come in here for the first time, they, they love it. They think it's so funny and cute, and so, you know, that's kind of the core of our place, you know, keeping it to dog-related and positive and having everyone leave, like, smiling, so. Cute. So, not, not smiling, but wagging their tails? Yes. <laughs> yeah. What do you love about this place? Um, my dog Otis loves to come here overnighting. Uh, when I go away, my husband and I go away on a trip and can't take him. He is happy to come here. What do you love about this place? I love coming here because I can drop Lola off in the morning before work and she can play with her friends and get all her exercise out and then I can come back for happy hour and have a glass of wine and she doesn't miss me during the day because she's just been here having fun. We bring them to Sniff three days a week and we've been coming here for a little over a year and they love it and we love it because they take such good care of them. and. 
it's clean and the people here just really spend a lot of time with the dogs and um, really do anything we ask them to, whether it comes to feeding them or loving them. They get really tired, so when we pick them up, they go to sleep. Oh, good. <laughs> so if I get in between here, can you get a tight shot? Do you think they'll kiss me? Maybe. Have a kiss? Oh, that's it. There we go. Kiss? Oh, oh, yay! Oh. Corey, what would you hope that people will take away from their experience here at Sniff Dog? What I'd hope they would say is that they really care. I mean, that ultimately, I, I, I want them our customers to feel that when they come here that we really do care because we do um, it's a family business um, you know everyone that works here too I feel like is is part of the family as well and that's the culture I want to create here and in, in that we really we really do care about each and every dog here and we want to give them the best time Corey thanks so much for having us here I can't wait to come back and visit thanks so much it was great to have you cheers All right, Lola, that was fun. Can't wait to come back.